people ask, you know, why why do you love motorsport? It's it's something that's it's very difficult to describe to someone what it's like to sit, you know, behind the driver's seat or the co-driver's seat and um, you know experience that adrenaline rush of trying to drive a car, you know, on a loose surface on gravel in between, you know, through the forest, um, you know, to its limit, and that that adrenaline rush and the challenge and the I guess the satisfaction when you when you get it right, it's, it's very addictive. You know, there's so many things that go into motorsport and into making you know one stage or one race happen that you know when you, you work so hard to get all the elements right the the feeling when you do get it right is is the the biggest high um, and it's you know it keeps fueling you on and I think one of the other fantastic things about motorsport is because there's there's so many elements that go into it there's so many people involved as well and you know it's it's maybe you behind the driver's seat but it's a whole team that's there with you and, and help to, to get the car ready and get to the events and make the events possible. So having that you know community that shares that passion is um, you know a really strong bond and um, that's something that you know it's a great thing to be a part of. Uh, probably nominated for, for never giving up. <laughs> um, you know I think that's something about rallying. It's you know you, you don't stop no matter what. Um, you know, we've had many instances where we've thought you know the car wouldn't get going and used other bits of the car or, or tie wraps or cable ties or I've even used hair clips to, to keep the car going so I think you know you, you never give up and um, you do whatever you can to, to get the car to the finish line whether that means you know driving it with three wheels or having you know a makeshift suspension um, you know it's the most important thing is to, to get to the finish. <laughs>